The award-winning Lee Pitts Live is brought to you by Tonya Lowe, a State Farm insurance agent. Honesty, respect, professionalism, and courtesy are always provided. Please like her on Facebook. By the School District of Lee County, where their goal is to be a world-class school system. By Biotech Pharmaceuticals in Fort Myers, where you can earn extra income by donating your plasma at no cost. And by Fifth Third Bank, the Curious Bank. Oh, Southwest Florida, I'm thrilled to come to you here from the River District in downtown Fort Myers. And uh, man, the accommodations here have been outstanding. The River District is a great place to come morning, noon, and night. Downtown Fort Myers, where Lee Pitts Live will be for the next 26 days that you'll see us on Fox 4 and LATV. So we're thrilled to have here some people who best represent the high ideas of the River District. Representatives from Fifth Third Bank, Christopher, and the good lieutenant from the Salvation Army, Lieutenant Needham. Gentlemen, welcome to the show. Thanks Thank for having you. us. Thank you for having us. I want you guys to make sure, since you're role models, that you tell everybody in TV land that there's nothing in those cups that you wouldn't be proud to be drinking. No. That's pretty clear. <laughs> it's clean. It's good. Okay. We're good. I'm so, so happy to, to get you here because, you know, when I first saw that a bank and Salvation Army were pa partnering together and I started reading through materials, like, how does this partnership work? What do they do together? Because that's one of the great things about my job. I get to meet all these, these yeah. fine people who are changing the community. Uh, but first, before we get to that, Christopher, a, a senior vice president at uh, Fifth Third Bank, Tell us what your responsibilities are. Sure. Uh, thanks for having me again. Um, so I'm, I'm the retail executive for the South Florida um, affiliate, which runs from Manatee County down to Naples, and then over on the East Coast, uh, West Palm Beach and uh, Fort Lauderdale. What are some things that fall under retail? Um, so all the financial centers, um, consumer lending, uh, all the products associated with the consumer side of the bank, and small, small business. No, so we really appreciate you taking time out of your busy schedule to come here with us. Thank you. How about that? And what do you actually do at the Salvation Army, Lieutenant? Uh, my wife and I are actually ordained ministers at the Salvation Army. Uh, the Salvation Army is doing great things in this community, in Collier County, Lee County, uh, Hidra and Glades County. We're feeding people. Uh, we're sheltering uh, women and children. Uh, we're doing things maybe people don't know about, and that's uh, helping out with people suffering from addiction. Uh, and then also we uh, help actually with medical and dental care here. I'm glad so. you said that. What is the biggest misconception about the Salvation Army? Uh, people don't know we're actually a church. That's a big misconception. The Salvation Army is a church. Uh, we're spreading uh, the Moves gospel of Jesus well. Christ. Well, spreading the gospel of Jesus Christ, and we do that through serving uh, the most, the people that meet, need it the most. Outstanding. The, um, now, the Salvation Army is feeding people. Fifth Third Bank is involved in that process. How in the world do we get a bank involved in a social cause like feeding people? Christopher, aren't all you guys concerned about is business? We're concerned about business, but we're also very concerned uh, about supporting our community. And we've been Excellent. doing that uh, for over 150 years at Fifth Third Bank. So partnering with the Salvation Army and helping to feed the communities is something that we really want to give back. Tell me how the process works. So we, uh, we, every one of our financial centers is, is a donation site. Uh, for feeding the community. So we're asking all our employees and also everyone in the community to come by Fifth Third Bank, drop off non-perishable foods. That includes foods like canned foods, uh, box cereals, peanut butter, anything that you have, please stop by. And our goal is to, is to exceed 5,300 pounds of food. And we partner well with the Salvation Army and Salvation Army is helping by uh, providing transportation for the 5,300 pounds of food. Okay, so people right now, any Fifth Third Bank that they see, go in there with non-perishable food. There'll be a friendly person to take it from Absolutely. you. Absolutely. You guys will take it from there. Yes. Lieutenant, how has that worked in the past? How has that partnership been with Fifth Third it's, Bank? It's well, wonderful. We've been able to feed 700 families a month uh, through our, our pantry program. Uh, and it's through the Amazing. support and help of, of Fifth Third Bank and uh, other people that support uh, the community and support the Salvation Army's work uh, now, in this community. Right. Now, I don't know if you got the answer to this, but I want to ask this question. Who was the smart person who thought of this? 
Uh, was it a, a meeting somewhere along the way years ago? Somebody, somebody said, way above me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so when you looked up, it was in place. Yeah, All right. exactly. Well, whoever that smart person is out there, yeah. give us a call. We'll plug your team. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the, uh, to, to actually, uh, Christopher, to actually work for a bank that does these type of outreach things, I see all the financial literacy that you're involved in, uh, helping people find jobs, just the whole curious bank. How does it feel for you to have that opportunity? Well, it feels great to be able to give back to the community. In fact, you know, this is really important to the bank. And we have a day called Fifth Third Bank. And it's on May 3rd, so 5-3 on your calendar. And this is a time that all of our employees give back to the community. It's where we recognize our employees, we thank our customers, and we really participate in activities to give back to the community. So I'm proud that we have a day like that so that, uh, so that we, can, we can give back. That's excellent. Uh, the, in, in, the, in the month of April, you got a, some great things going on in the community in the month of April. Yes. I know the e-bus is, is moving around as well. I actually got a chance to go into the e-bus. I sneaked up on Jadero and plugging. I walked I, up on the e-bus. I e heard you Hodge were there. University. I heard you were there. Tell people what the e-bus is. <laughs> so the e-bus, it's a retrofitted uh, city bus and it's full of uh, computer workstations and they're powered by satellite. So we can take the e-bus around to communities and really, you know, um, carry out financial ed education out in the communities. Mm -hmm. The, uh, what do you expect to accomplish when, what do you hope that would be accomplished when people go into that e-bus? We, well, we'll team up with them so if they have anything that they, they need a computer for. Uh, maybe filing taxes or uh, uh, financial education. We can bring that right to the communities. Uh, it's full computers and we can work with uh, anyone in the community to, uh, you know, to help them out. How do you define financial literacy? I mean, just in a nutshell, when you say financial literacy, it means making people more aware of their budgeting, uh, credits. Yes, but budgeting, um, credit, um, just full education around how to, you know, on day to day, how to how to control your finances. Mm -hmm. And reading about Fifth Third Bank, it appears that you not appears. I see where you Fifth Third Bank has received a lot of awards for its unique way and approach and creative ways in getting to the people. Uh, yes. Can you mention an award or two and how do you feel about that? Well, I can tell you that one of the things we have going on right now. So we've teamed up with uh, Dave Ramsey, and he's a well-known uh, syndicated talk show host, and he's challenged high school students across across the country to really improve on their financial uh, literacy skills. So there's a quiz out there, and, the, and if you go to www.53schools.com, uh, there's a quiz there. And for any high school students that scores 100, then they are eligible for a prize. So the first prize is a $36,000 scholarship that will be given to a high school senior, and that scholarship is sponsored by Fifth Third Bank. Uh, second prize is a $5,000 scholarship. Third prize is a... Is a is a uh, $2,500 scholarship. And then there's some laptops also. So we encourage anyone, uh, all the high school students, to really you know, gain on their financial literacy, their financial knowledge, and take advantage of it. Maybe you'll win a scholarship. Let's get that website one more time. It's uh, www.53schools.com. And the contest runs between uh, now and uh, April the 24th. Excellent. Uh, the food drive yes. uh, is going on as we speak. Uh, and, and when does it end? Uh, April 24th. April 24th. Oh. <laughs> I found it. <laughs> All right. Eight third bank can tell you about yeah. that. Yes. The, uh, the, um, let's go back to Fifth Third Bank and its community, uh, its environment in the community and, and, and the culture that you have there in the bank. Do you, you encourage employees to volunteer, get out in the community and do these types of things? Is there a program in place for that? Yes, we do. We, we encourage our employees, and we don't have to encourage very hard. All of our employees love to participate in, in, in outreach and in the communities. The, uh, when you, you uh, Lieutenant, the relationship that you have with Fifth Third Bank and carrying out your mission, how would you describe the, the various ways that Fifth Third ha helps you in carrying out your great mission? Oh, they do a great, uh, great way to support us. Um, they provide all this food. We, we feed 700 families a month mm. in Southwest Florida. That's through our food pantries, and that, uh, that wouldn't happen if we didn't have great support from Fifth Third Bank and other uh, people in the community, other companies in the community. Let me see you guys shake hands right there. We'll get that on yes, Facebook. Absolutely. Thank you. Partnership, Fifth Third yes, Bank sir. and the Salvation Army. Well, gentlemen, it's been a pleasure having you both on the show. Thank, Thank you, sir. Thanks I want for you to uh, continue to make a difference in the community, okay? Okay, yes, sir. Okay, so as the saying goes on this particular show, for those who say it can't be done, they're usually interrupted by those like the fine people at the Salvation Army and Fifth Third Bank who are making a difference. 
Fifth Third Bank, the Curious Bank. We'll be right back with Lashiba Travis.